Hi, my name is Andrew Truman Kim, and I'm a member of APAPA. Um, I'm a board member and the vice chair of our Davis chapter. And the first question is, why am I involved with civic engagement? Uh, in context of civic engagement for Asian Americans, um, there's two points that I think are very important. Number one is just catching up to um, appropriate representation for our leadership uh, in the API community. API community is very emerging demographic, uh, not just in California, but in the United States. But our elected policy leaders um, don't necessarily uh, reflect um, the population. So I think it's very important to, for us to elect leadership that will be mindful of the needs, the policy needs of Asian Americans, um, Asian Pacific Islander Americans. And the second reason is leadership in itself altogether. I think an important piece of civic engagement is leadership development. And this is not just in the context of politics or political campaigns. This is leadership in every aspect of life, from the private sector, public sector, in a community organizing work and community development work, where folks are willing to take more ownership uh, and to engage more people, uh, both in the public policy process and both in community development process. The second question is, how am I participating in civic engagement? I myself am unique in the sense that I've started this work 10 years ago, um, working in um, a gubernatorial campaign, working in a presidential campaign, and multiple congressional campaigns. And so I got the bug uh, pretty early on for the last 10 years. Um, but I also participate in community organizations. Uh, again, that uh, some um, that are partisan, some that are nonpartisan, some that are just focused on getting more young people educated on issues that are important for both the community, issues that are important for them, such as professional development, career development, or financial literacy, and organizations that, like APAPA, and today's event, that are really trying to advance uh, Asian Americans in leadership when it comes to the political process. The last question is, what changes do I want to see in the future? Um, I think a big issue that we are talking is um, about the one of our greatest strengths as APIAs is our diversity, um, but it can also be um, an obstacle because there's so many different organizations. There's the Chinese American Associations, the Korean American Association, the Japanese American Association, and all the groups that participated today. And th um, the question is, how can all of these groups work together so we can have a joint pathway to victory plan, a joint programming, joint trainings, so that we can leverage our resources to amplify our impact, our, uh, amplify our value proposition, avoid duplication, avoid uh, redundancy, and double down on the priorities that not only impact Asian Americans, but all Americans.